there is a difference between creating art just for fun, like for absolute pleasure, because you enjoy the process, you love how it makes you feel, and it doesn't matter what that style is. Yes, there's a lot of different styles of art that I, I do and partake in that it's just for me, it's just for fun. But then I also have this platform of a very specific style of art that I genuinely enjoy. And there's it's attracted a, a specific audience into it. You do have to have an outlet of art and, and experiment that you have to do on your own even if it's not a popular style, even if it's not within what you've already commercialized and what you've attracted your huge audience with. You have to do that just for your soul, just so that, even for your growth, because sometimes experimentation will bring out a style of art that you never thought of. Once you set a platform and once you have a flow going, uh, part of being a, a art entrepreneur or art entrepreneur is being consistent and knowing when your audience is ready for you to evolve. There will be a time for that, for you to evolve. But you have to gauge your audience. And that's why it's important to go back to the beginning is finding a genre, even a niche genre that's true to you, that you will never truly lack inspiration, ever. That's why it has to be true to you. That's why you have to love it so much. So um, experiment. Do that for, on your, by yourself, on your own, with, with your art, but also serve the audience that has taken the time to give uh, and support for your work. Uh, I think they deserve an evolution of you in that as well, and try to find the balance.